are you guys ready for more Lego promotional items slash stacking our Lego sales? If so, you most likely stumbled across the right channel because in today's video, we are going to be taking a look at the upcoming, well, tonight's release of the Lego GWPs that are going to be available. So yes, October 23rd, pretty exciting stuff, guys. We should have a nice little wave of gift with purchases from what we know so i'm really pumped if that interests you stick around hit that subscribe button it should be a pretty fun video and of course we're going to discuss my plan for this release well just before we begin and take a look and start planning this whole entire shopping experience out i just wanted to let you guys know we will be doing a midnight live stream for this release of the promos i think it's going to be a really fun time and i know we we should just do it i just think i just have that feeling we should just do it i think it'll be pretty fun so if you guys are interested in shopping with us live i will link that in the description below to head over to that live stream but uh, if not you could just subscribe to the channel hit that notification bell and you'll get pinged when we go live but i will have that planned about a little bit ahead we should have some really cool guests on as well so You'll be excited to see who we have on for tonight's show, but it'll be pretty fun. I'm excited. A lot of gift with purchases, and uh, it's a little pre-November 1st midnight release stream. So with that being said, let's jump into today's video, ladies and gentlemen. Of course, we're going to be focusing on the Lego Shop at Home page because, well, we should have a handful of promotional items that are going to kick off tonight at the midnight release stream so one of the first promotional items guys is going to be the houses of the world four so this is the fourth that's that's a let me try that again the fourth installment of the houses of the world and it looks like it's for 20 euros but it's also 20 us is kind of that lego price it kind of gives us uh but essentially if you are unfamiliar, way back in January, Lego announced that they were going to bring houses of the world, meaning just houses from different regions across the beautiful globe of architecture uh, into a Lego set micro scale. And unfortunately, these sets had extremely high thresholds of $250. So we can concur that this set is also going to be attainable by 250 dollars us so that is the set we are looking at here it is on another picture check out those doors <laughs> little micro scale doors uh the roof pitch looks pretty sweet this is obviously an asian uh architecture style house but i'm actually really excited for this one i did collect all three so you guys know me um i have to have it and that's why our credit card is may as well get the lighter to it <laughs> it's seen better days <laughs> but anyways i i have to have it i'm a collector so i have to have it so that's one of the reasons we're making today's video so we can just kind of get a, an overview of what we need to do uh to get this set uh, so obviously i said that's a 250 dollar threshold i have to have it <laughs> <laughs> is it cheaper just to get it on ebay well unfortunately that's why i had this pulled up unfortunately the prices look pretty steep i think the cheapest one from china 50 dollars plus yeah you lo you're looking at like 65 70 bucks shipped to have this thing in your hands which is an absolute absurd price I, when I, i'd rather just spend the money and get some lego that i want to enjoy and build on my on my weekends right like i think that's that's probably the better case scenario um I, I went down the rabbit hole. I thought at the beginning of the year, I was going to chase down every single Lego GWP and I would make a sick video at the end of the year. It, it didn't happen, guys. So don't expect much at the end of this year. It, it didn't happen. I tried. I just really couldn't keep up. So I just just bear with me as we discuss that. Um, and I know we're doing a little promos recap. So uh, and for those of you who watched our last video where we did recover our pro uh, go over our promos, I do apologize. Uh, this is maybe a little bit repetitive, but uh, we need to discuss this to formulate a plan in more detail. So that's the first gift with purchase that's going to be releasing tonight here on october 23rd and that's actually supposed to be available all the way to the 31st giving us a about eight day window to pick this up i'm going to say that but i'm going to also say while supplies last of course this being the fourth houses of the world automatically the demand shoots up a little bit so uh, it's also dependent on is if there's more lego sales as well as um if people are feel like buying and I know we're getting into Q4 and uh, people are wanting to buy more, I sure as heck am. I've just been loading up on Lego deals. But uh, anyways, I don't, we don't have to talk too much there. Uh, the other gift with purchase, I guess we'll come back to this one because it's it's a little bit different. It's a little bit more unique. Bear with me. We'll get to that one. Don't 
Don't worry. Don't worry. Uh, the other one is a set that's available on the Shop at Disney website, official. Uh, it's the Lego official name is Steamboat Willie, and it's set number 40659. So if you check on our good old friend eBay, this bad boy is all over the place. Um, 42 plus $15 shipping. So you're getting, you're in that $60 price range already 60 bucks. And this set is attainable by spending $150 here on the Disney page. And honestly, I believe I was preluded to believe it was going to be a hundred dollars at lego.com. Uh, I'm not sure how accurate it is. I actually don't know off the top of my head. I don't remember. Um, but regardless, even if it's a hundred or 150, my goal would to be, would to be spent 250, um, to kind of stack the Houses of the World 4 promo, uh, which means we have to spend $250, um, of course, on Lego, and 150 of that would have to be, or 100 would have to be uh, on Disney Lego to get that. And I believe Star Wars was included in this. So we could essentially buy a $250 Lego Star Wars set and get both those Lego promotional items. So that's the plan. The other option is we hold the bag. We say, no, no, no. We are not shopping today because there's a third stackable gift with purchase coming on October 27th, rumored, that this should be dropping on October 27th is the moving truck. Now, this is a little bit different. You won't be able to triple promo stack because this set would only be attainable by buying one of the five lego modular buildings so the this set is i mean it's a great set and it only goes for around 30 to like 40 bucks i would say in that price range um so do your own due diligence if you just want to cop one go ahead and scoop that bad boy up wherever you can but anyways really cool set but regardless it's only attainable by buying a the lego bookshop b the assembly square c the jazz club did i miss the d <laughs> the boutique hotel and e the police station okay that's all five i named all five um i did get pat on the back christo thank you smash that like button i do this for free come on guys <laughs> um no i'm serious smash that like button it means the world to me and of course if you haven't subscribed just hit that subscribe button it's it's a simple one click wonder um <laughs> i i get sidetracked easy i'm that's that's why i buy so much lego guys so thank you for supporting my bad habits we appreciate you here at the stud city show but anyways, <laughs> back to back to the information. This will not be stackable because if you buy a modular, that's not dizzy, meaning you won't get the Steamboat Willie GWP. So no matter what, this is only attainable by double stack. So holding out is probably not the best option. If you were to hold out, you could buy a modular building like Assembly Square and get the moving truck GWP as well as the houses of the world four. And is that really worth it? Uh, it depends how bad you want the houses of the world four. I really don't want to miss this one because it's the only one out of the four I don't have. I'd, I'd feel pretty silly if I, you know, dropped all the money to get the first three and I didn't scoop up this one. So uh, that, that's kind of where I stand. I just feel like my luck, uh, it sells out immediately and it's like 150 bucks on eBay. And I'm just like, oh, but I, that, that's like worst case scenario, right? I always like to be an extremist in these situations and think worst case scenario. So that gives us back to the original question. Christo, what the frick is your plan? My plan is to shop absolutely irresponsibly and swipe the card with you guys tonight on our live stream at midnight. Um, uh, we've been buying like Lego like crazy. So why stop now? Uh, I absolutely enjoy it. I know you guys enjoy it. So I think we should. Now, what set do we buy? I think uh, we should probably scoop up some sets that are either on sale or 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 bear with me are i thought it was over here last chance to buy last chance to buy last call everybody likes the last call so the last call page is just a bunch of lego sets that uh, lego's kind of indicating that are going to be retiring here in 2024 as soon as we roll into 2024 uh the production has stopped and it's the last chance to get them unfortunately a lot of these sets i feel like we can get 20 percent off at just local other retail stores so i just don't think it's worth it so my actual plan i know i know this you guys are being patient today <laughs> and i appreciate it and it's, it's taken me a minute to find where i need to go I kind of wanted to scoop up some of, and it might not be a good plan, um, but I was thinking of grabbing maybe a gunship or two, or just other sets that I want from the Ahsoka show that I just really want to build. And maybe that's not a best plan just because those came out. Um, so I might have to refine refine that plan just a little bit. Uh, again, maybe focus on 
more important sets that are retiring at the end of the year and just maybe some Star Wars sets I don't have. But if I could get Star Wars sets or other, like, to get this Disney Steamboat Willie, I think it's probably well worth the money spent to stack those promos. That's just kind of where my head's at. I think that's uh, essentially where I'm at. Exactly what set. I can't give that to you right now just because... I, I really don't know. It's kind of up in the air, and honestly, I usually tend to like make those decisions last minute, but I have a general idea. Um, I'm thinking I pick up some Star Wars sets. I was really leaning towards a Coruscant gunship and uh, some other miscellaneous sets, but that's just kind of immediate brain reaction. But anyways, uh, oh, also the helmet collection. I think I was going to add a couple more of those, but that's just a thought. Anyways, I don't want to wrap this video on too long, guys. Um, that's sort of my plan. We're planning on buying. That's the moral of the story because we want those G those 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 juicy, juicy GWPs. So if you're with me, see you tonight on the live stream. If you stood around to the end of today's video, appreciate you. We don't have a sponsor for today's video, so you guys know what that means. We use a Pokemon collect card from our collection to showcase... We don't have a sponsor, but Pokemon is another hobby of ours that we enjoy. And this is a card from when I was a kid. It's a good old Wigglytuff in the Jungle First Edition. If you guys want to see more Pokemon cards from my collection, hit that subscribe button because I like to show off a card in every single video. So anyways, guys, see you live tonight. Love you guys. Hope you have an amazing rest of the day. My name is Christo from Stud City. We'll see you in the next one. Actually, we'll see you tonight. Peace out.